Hello, in today's video, I'll show you how to needle felt using polyfillous cores. I will also tell you some of the pros and cons of using polyfill, so you can decide whether you should use it or not. Polyfill is a great alternative for core wool due to its price and availability. Polyfill is very short in length, so it's kinda hard to roll it like core wool. Instead, we can just grab it and start felting it. In the beginning, it feels like we are stabbing air because polyfill is so loose and fluffy. But if we keep stabbing, it will eventually form the shape. Because of how fluffy polyfill is, it will take little more time to felt compared to core wool. If you already watched some of my videos, you probably know that I love using polyfill because I use it in almost every video. It is quite versatile. You can use it for many shapes. Here is a peacatch I made. The core is made of polyfill. After finish making the shape, I just cover the polyfill with color wool. We can also use polyfill for more complicated shapes. A while ago I needle felted my cat coffee using polyfillous core. As you can see, polyfill does do the job pretty well. I'm quite happy with how it turned out and I have been using polyfillous cores ever since. Different brands of polyfill can have different quality. I have only used one brand so I do not know if all brands work the same. If you are looking to get into needle felting, I highly recommend you trying it out because it can save you some money. I'm trying to make a pokeball here. The size is not big enough yet. Let's increase it. And just like core wool, we simply add more polyfill on top if we want to increase the size. One of the disadvantages of using polyfill is that it's harder to tell how much we need for the size we want because it's so fluffy. This ball shape took me about 20 minutes to felt with polyfill, which is not bad. Once we have the core ready, we can just start felting our color wool on top of the polyfill. It's harder to get a smooth shape with polyfill, so we will need to do more stabbing when adding the color wool to get a smooth finish. Here is one of the worst things about polyfill. Polyfill is made with polyester, so the texture can look very cheap with a plasticky look. It may not be a problem, since we will be covering it with color wool anyway. But if we are making a white shape, we will still have to cover it with white wool even though polyfill is white. Sometimes we can just use the core walls to the finished surface, but that's not the case for polyfill. We will have to cover every inch with our color wool, where with core wool it's okay to have some thin spots showing core wool underneath. And here is an example. There is a spot I didn't cover it well enough. If we take a closer look, we can see some of the polyfill underneath. So we will have to be very careful if we decide to use polyfill as core. We can easily fix these spots by adding more fiber, but it's just more work. Needle felting is already a very time consuming craft and many felters probably want to speed things up. So if you are doing many projects with white color, Core wool is definitely a better option for you. If you want to use polyfill for saving money and don't want to deal with some of the problems it has, you can use polyfill and core wool together by felting the shape smaller with polyfill and then increase the size with core wool. This way you still save money using polyfill and don't have the ugly plastic look. The only downside is it still takes time, probably even more time than just using polyfill. In conclusion, I recommend using core wool if possible, especially if you are a beginner and still learning needle felting. With core wool we don't have to deal with the nuisances that come with polyfill. Also polyfill is synthetic, so it's not exactly environment friendly. Despite the downsides, I still like using polyfill as my core. Polyfill can work wonder if you know exactly what you are getting into. Not only it's cheaper, it's also very easy to buy. You can easily find them at local stores or on Amazon. Here is the list of pros and cons for using polyfillers core. If you find this video helpful, please consider liking the video and subscribe to my channel. I make tutorials on needle felting video games and anime characters. Thank you so much for watching. Here is a clip of coffee waking up to a treat. See you in the next video.